What's up, everyone? It's me, KG, Chris Gardner, owner of the Houston Round Ball Review. Recently, the Big 12 announced the preseason polls for men's and women's basketball. I'm going to try something different. I made a little video slide presentation with my old brain. Check it out. And then hopefully if it works, tell me if you like it, leave me a comment below with the video. And we'll keep on moving forward. Houston Round Bar Review since 1994. Local name, global perspective. Check it out. In first place, for the first time in Big 12 and school history, Kansas State, seven, plus, seven first place votes, 211 points. Second, Iowa State, six first place votes, 209 points. In third, Baylor, Lady Bears with two first place votes, 194 points. TCU in fourth with 185 points. In fifth, West Virginia, one first place vote. 184 points in six. The first newcomer from the Pac-12, the Utah Utes, with 149 points. Seventh place, Arizona, and 136 points. In eight, Kansas Jayhawks with 128 points. Ninth place, the third newcomer from the Pac-12, Colorado, with 113 points. Tenth place, Texas Tech, 84 points. Eleventh, Oklahoma State, 80 points. Twelfth, BYU with 59 points, 13, Cincinnati with 56 points, 14, UCF with 54 points, 15th, the last, the fourth and final newcomer from the Pac-12, Arizona State with 51 points, and in 16th, 16th place, the Houston Cougars with 27 points. On the men's side, in first place, for like the 20th time in league history, Kansas Jayhawks and Coach Bill Self with nine first place votes, 215 points. In second, twos in the league, second time in the top two, the Houston Cougars with five first place votes, 211 points. Third place, Iowa State, one first place vote, 194 points. Fourth place, Baylor with 185 points. Fifth place, the first newcomer on the men's side from the Pac-12, Arizona with one first place vote. 179 points in sixth, second year in the league, Cincinnati with 140 points, seventh place, Texas Tech, 135 points, eighth place, Kansas State with 133 points, in ninth, BYU with 116 points, 10, TCU with 90 points, 11, UCF, 83 points, 12, newcomer, Arizona State, 64 points, 13, West Virginia, 62 points, 14, Oklahoma State with 46 points, 15, the last newcomer, Colorado, no, not, not the last newcomer, Colorado with 37 points, and in 16, the, the last newcomer, the Utah Utes with 30 points. So there you have it, the results of the Big 12's men's and women's preseason basketball polls. We'll talk about it right now. Let's get into it. Let's have some fun. Peace. What are your thoughts on it? What are your thoughts on the results? Anything surprise you? Anything disappoint you on the men's or women's side of those preseason basketball polls? Big 12 tip-off slash media days take place October 22nd and 23rd in Kansas City at the T-Mobile Center. I hope to be there. All signs point to I will be there. If you want to contribute, let me give you some plug shout-outs, some advertising promos while I'm there. Just let me know. Hit me up. You saw the email. Advertise at the HRR.com. Let me know your thoughts also on the little video slide presentation. Just try something different. Trying to, you know, expand the repertoire and get more interest and more eyeballs here on the Houston Round Ball Reviews YouTube channel. But once again, email me right there at advertise at the HRR.com. And also, ways to support. You saw the slide. This is business, folks. Ways to support the Houston Round Bar Review via the Cash App, Zelle, or PayPal. So there's different ways to support the Houston Round Bar Review and me to keep doing this for another 30 years. Because, as I said in the beginning, the Houston Round Ball Review has been around since 1994.
subscribe to this channel. Support this channel. Spread the word about this channel. Buy some merch. Buy a cap. Buy a hat. Buy a mug. Buy a hoodie. It's hot here in Houston, but, you know, it's cool somewhere else in the world. So click on that shop button as well. Spread the word. Because since 1994, 1994, the Houston Round Ball Review, local name, global perspective. Everyone, take care.